Hello, good evening. The skyline in East Kent looks very different tonight. The cooling towers at Richborough have been demolished. Crowds gathered first thing this morning to watch the 50-year-old concrete landmarks disappear in a puff of smoke. Our environment correspondent Yvette Austin joined them. 5,000 tonnes of reinforced concrete split through its seams. As dawn broke this morning on the condemned towers, people were up and heading out to secure a good view. Cars lined the roads, cameras at the ready. Just seconds to go now and many of the roads around Richborough, around the exclusion zone, are blocked. People have got out of their cars and are walking into the fields, waiting for nine o'clock to come. The intention, a highly choreographed performance with explosions timed to take down each tower in turn. They'd been there long enough, they were a blot on the landscape, you know, and uh, I think it was time they came down. I felt quite moved. It's slightly sentimental, but uh, some people are glad it's gone. I didn't protest about it, but it's sad. Some thought of them as an icon, others an eyesore. Whichever way, a relic of 1960s industry has been reduced to rubble. Yvette Austin, BBC South East Today, Richborough.